possible. I, I, I must be hallucinating or dreaming or, or something because it cannot be you. But it is. Antonio. <sighs> Just go away. Go, go away. You're not real. Sheridan. Sheridan, look at me. It's me. I am alive. And I've come back for you, okay? And if I have to fight my brother to be with you, I will. I'll fight him to the death if I have to. Because I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Do you still think I'm dead? Uh, Antonio. Antonio. I don't I don't understand. How are you alive? I, I don't get it. I saw your plane crash. There are pieces of it still at the bottom of the harbor. It was just another one of your father's sick tricks. See, I wasn't even on that plane. I was on another. I've been held his prisoner this whole time. Where? Where have you been? And how, how did you get here? Well, that's the frustrating part. I wasn't even that far away. I was held in some secret apartment in the bottom of one of the crane buildings in Boston. I mean, your father, well, he just wanted to keep me on ice for some reason. I, I had everything I needed. Food, gym, television, newspapers, guards, lots of guards. I'd see you on the television and I'd read about you in the papers and it was hell, Sheridan. How did you escape? For some reason, the guards' paychecks just stopped showing up. And this morning, they all just took off. Father's dead. So whoever was authorizing the payroll for those guards must have canceled it. Oh, thank goodness the old bastard finally croaked. Yeah. It took me hours to get out of those locks, but as soon as I did, I came straight back here to Harmony. And that's when I found out about the weddings. Well, then you must know you don't have to fight Luis for me. He doesn't love me anymore. He's in love with Fancy. He's gonna marry her today. Oh my God, Antonio, you've gotta get inside that church. You've, you've gotta tell your family that you're alive. Tell your loved ones that you're here. Sure. That's exactly what I'm doing right now. I love you.